Hey people, today let's talk about mobile wallets and the Unified Payment Interface by National Payment Corporation of India. Unified Payment Interface is all set to change the mobile wallet marketplace in India as it aims to make transactions easy. As a result, banks can now roll out more user-friendly apps on par with mobile wallets. Since last 2-3 years, we have seen a massive growth in the mobile wallet industry. Services like MobiQuick, Momi, FreeCharge, Oxygen and Paytm has grown exponentially, mainly because of characteristics like user-friendly UI, ease of uses and on top of that lucrative incentives like cashback and discounts to lure the customer into using their services. Personally, I don't think there is an issue in this approach but freebies can help you attract and retain customers but it cannot be a sustainable growth plan for any serious service provider. So now the calculation comes to economics of scale. With almost 1 billion mobile connections in India and one of the fastest growing smartphone markets in the world, every player wants a piece of this pie and wallet services are increasingly trying to act as banks and preferred tool for online and offline point of sale transactions. Now here comes the Unified Payment Interface or the UPI. This is mainly aimed at easy interoperability between banks to banks and banks to other payment system players like wallets. The second wave of mobile wallet services growth will come from offline transactions from physical merchant outlets like QR code based transactions, NFC based transactions, SMS, USSD based transactions. And with the introduction of UPI, banks will have one more mode of payments other than debit and credit cards. Now they will have UPI based apps. Some players have already embraced the UPI like a mobile wallet service called Ultracrash, SBI with an app called Buddy and Pockets by ICICI Bank. This might be a game changer for the mobile wallet industry as people may prefer using the bank based point of sale apps instead of the wallet based point of sale apps. So we conclude that after e-commerce, the mobile wallet and payment space is going to heat up even more. This may well turn out to be a win-win situation for at least one of the stakeholders in this chaos, that is the customers.